Matthew Ladd here, behind the wheel of a Kenworth T800 72 inch sleeper, currently available for sale. I'll put the link in the description. But that aside, I wanna to talk to you today about manual transmissions. Yes, most of the industry is moving to automated manual 12 speed and 18 speed transmissions. But today I wanna to talk to you about the differences between a 13 speed manual and an 18 speed manual. What it comes down to is the split gears. And I'm gonna show you what the split gear is and I'm gonna show you a little top view, see how the gears are set up on a heavy duty truck versus what a lot of people not in the trucking industry are used to, a manual transmission car. Let's go take a look at the differences between a 13 and an 18 speed manual transmission. So for all the non-truckers out there, I just wanna show you the side controls here on a manual transmission. First, you have the gear split here, which is easy to move with your thumb when your hand is on top. And then you have the paddle shifter here, which takes you between your high and your low gears. Now to explain this better, we're just gonna drop down here and look at the top where it shows what gears. So when I'm saying high, low, the half splits, this is an 18 speed transmission. On an 18, you have the high, low in low gear, gear one, two, three, and four. When you have a 13 speed manual transmission, you only have the splits on gear five, six, seven, and eight. Now, why would you want to have an 18 speed with split gears on gear one, two, three, and four? This is really to maintain your power, your horsepower, and your torque when hauling heavier, when you need more control over the engine and more control over your power. Versus if you had a 13 speed, you don't necessarily need that control in the low gears, you more need it in the high gears. So that is the difference between a 13 speed and an 18 speed manual transmission. And that's a quick look for everybody out there who maybe didn't really understand differences between a 13 and 18 or who aren't in the trucking industry and have never seen a trucking transmission before. I'm sure the professionals out there, the amazing truck drivers that keep these trucks on the road will know a lot more about the differences between the 13 and the 18. But at the end of the day, with an 18 speed transmission, you have more control over the splits in your gears to have shorter steps between gears and maintain your power, whether you're taking off or you're going up a large hill with a heavy load. That's Group Count Montreal TNT, Trucks and Tips, and I'm Matthew Ladd. Stay tuned for more tips in the future. Thank you.